This is a Cyber Cops Awareness video. In this video, we'll discuss Is ethical hacking legal in India? Hacking in common parlance is understood as unauthorized access to a computer or network. In most of the cases hackers leverage the vulnerabilities including zero-day vulnerabilities to accomplish unauthorized intrusion categories of hackers. First is white hat hackers. They are also known as ethical hackers. They use their computer skills to protect and secure the systems from malicious elements. Second is black hat hackers. They are also known as crackers. They have malice in their hearts and hack into an entity for personal gains. And the last is gray hat hackers. They become white hat or black hat hacker as per the situation. So they are not trustworthy. What is ethical hacking? Ethical hacking is the study of vulnerabilities and weaknesses of a system or network with prior consent of the owner by cybersecurity experts. And the person recruited for this purpose is called ethical hacker. It enables security officers to patch the vulnerabilities before black hat hackers exploit it for personal gains. Thus, ethical hacking is constructed as good hacking. Importance of ethical hacking? In recent times, there has been a massive increase in number of hacking attempts. Data of even large organizations like Facebook are getting compromised. Since, any theft of sensitive personal information can put the customers at risk. For example, if passwords get stolen in hacking attacks, it puts several accounts of users at risk. Thus, any successful hacking by black hat hacker can seriously point fingers at the credibility of the organization. The other threat is ransomware attacks. It prevents users from accessing their own system or personal files. The attackers demand ransom in order to regain access to files. So the continuous cyber attacks have forced entities to employ ethical hackers. History of ethical hacking the earliest reported ethical hacking were conducted by U.S. military agencies to test the security worthiness of their systems before deploying them on full-fledged basis. As Internet exploded it gave birth to systematic study of vulnerabilities and exploits in the systems. Ethical hacking in India It must be borne in mind that hacking is illegal. As per Indian Laws Information Technology Act 2000, here are the relevant section reproduced associated with ethical hacking. Section 43 Penalty and compensation for damage to computer or computer system. The person shall be punished if he or she without permission of the owner or any other person who is in charge of a computer, computer system or computer network. Access to such computer or computer network. Downloads copies or extracts any data or information from such computer, introduces or causes to be introduced any computer contaminant or virus into any computer or network, damages or causes to be damaged any computer or network, data, database or any other programs, disrupts or causes disruption of any computer, denies or causes the denial of access to any person, authorized to access any computer, provides any assistance to any person to facilitate access to a computer system or network in contravention of the provisions of this act charges the services availed of by a person to the account of another person by tampering with or manipulating any computer destroys deletes or alters any information residing in a computer resource steal conceal destroys or causes any person to steal conceal destroy or any computer source code. According to this section, computer contaminant means any set of computer instructions that are designed to modify, record, transmit data residing within a computer computer system. Computer database means a representation of information, knowledge, facts, or instructions in text, image, audio, video. Computer virus means any computer instruction that adversely affects the performance of a computer resource. 
Damage means to destroy, alter, delete, modify any computer resource. Computer source code means the listing of program, computer commands. Design and program analysis of computer resource. Punishments. The punishment has been provided under Section 66 of IT Act 2000. According to this, if any person fraudulently does any act referred to in Section 43, he shall be punishable with imprisonment for a term which may extend to three years or with fine which may extend to five lakh rupees or with both. Importance of ethical hacking in India. According to Indian criminal jurisprudence principle, whether they satisfy the ingredients to constitute a crime. First is mens rea which means gully mind. Second is actus reus which means physical action. In ethical hacking the first ingredient, that is mens rea means bad intention is missing. Therefore, it's not a crime. Growing demand of ethical hacking in India. India stands at second position in terms of number of targeted cyber attacks. Therefore, for websites to function properly, ethical hacking is the need of the hour. Main motive is to protect the system from black hat hackers. It's definitely legal and should be promoted. Ethical hacking as a profession. Cyber attacks especially data theft, ransomware threaten to nullify the gains of the virtual world. Therefore cyber security has rapidly emerged as new profession. The possible career options in cyber security domain include Computer software engineer Database administrator Information security lead Network security Ethical hacker Specialized pen tester And so on. How to become ethical hacker To become ethical hacker one should have Knowledge of programming languages like Python, C++, C, Ruby etc. Also, he should have good knowledge of Operating systems like Linux, Windows. So ethical hacking has not been dealt explicitly by Indian laws. And is not illegal in India. Be alert. Stay safe.